Hi, I'm Lacey Holland of Love Your Skin Day Spa, and I'm about to do a tutorial of how to use your DIY facial kit. Now there's some other things that are in some of the kits that are for your self care, for taking a bath or whatnot. So feel free to do part of this in your bath or before your bath or whatever. But I'm gonna go through the five steps of the little DIY mini facial. So you should have received your products. You have a cleanser, an exfoliant, a warm treatment, a mask, and a moisturizer. So I hope you have those five uh, things, and they may vary because I am making them so that there are products for different skin types. And then also what you're gonna need for this is, um, I prefer to use a washcloth. I like the ones with a little bit of a scrubby, but we're still gonna, we're not gonna crazy scrub our skin, but we're gonna use this to kind of get off some extra makeup. Um, a cotton round of sorts, which should be in your kit. I forgot one because I now use the reusable ones we have at the spa, which are pretty amazing, by the way. It's a set of 20 that comes in this cute little um, reusable jar. Um, I've got some of them used up, um, but you can wash them and use them over and over. So good for the environment. Um, your brush, it's a, um, instead of having actual bristles, it's a silicone brush, so it's easy to clean and no bacteria will build up. And then optionally, headband. I'm going to put that on real quick because I just did my hair. I'm trying to let it be till tomorrow, okay? So when you are set, it is time to do your little mini facial. So we are going to start with cleansing and now inside each of your um, card, uh, paper things, whatever this is called, your samples, comes out a little package. And so this one uh, you can see has a exit out the middle, but some of the other foil packets have a corner edge. Um, or I mean, they have you want to strip straight across, but most of these products are enough to at least do two to three times. So you want to preserve them. So you can sit them upright in a plastic baggie and reuse. So for the ones with the little thing in the middle, you can just cut across, or for the other ones, just cut off a corner. And as I said, keep them upright. So I'm starting with the stone crop cleansing oil, and I'm going to dispense a little bit into my hands here. Of course, it's not gonna wanna come out. Awesome. So I'll cut a little more off <laughs> of my packet here. There we are. Eminence products are really rich, so you don't need to use much. Okay, so I have my cleanser. My oil, this is the oil cleanser. So this is also gonna be a really good thing to see how easy this takes off makeup. Okay, see so I've got eyeliner, mascara. Now this isn't waterproof. And I've got lipstick. I start by using this oil cleanser just straight on the face. No water needed right in the beginning. However, you can start to get your water warm. But I really like to massage this into the skin. I mean, it feels good. It smells amazing. And as you can see, and I show you this, I even go across my um, eyes and I can even open my eyes with this product. It doesn't bother my eyes. Might as well even get my lipstick off. But it basically is just taking my makeup off already, which is pretty cool, huh? So just some massage, it feels so good. You can get in your sinuses, oh. And down your neck, because we want to treat our neck too. Who wants a beautifully aged face and a saggy turkey neck? Nobody. Okay, wash off, getting a little bit of warm, not too hot water, I know the hot water feels good but it's really dehydrating to the skin. So a little bit of warm water, and now this is the beauty of this product. I had a full face of makeup on. I wear mineral makeup. And with this one easy step, even, I'm going really gently around my eyes, but even my eye makeup is gone. I just give it a couple uh, swipes. Ooh, stress acne. Uh, actually, that's dietary sugar. Stress, hormones. I'm dealing with a, little, a few breakouts right now, which I normally don't have, but this is a crazy time in our lives. Okay, so clean. You didn't see all my eye makeup, gone. Now you will get your um, exfoliating peel. I've already opened this one, except I bent it off down far enough. And you will put um, about half of this packet onto your little cotton round, or you could do the full packet, whatever you feel. Once you have it on there, actually with this one, I would say try to put most of the packet on there. Okay, so 
onto your cotton round, whichever kind of cotton round you have. And with this, you just kind of want to start at the top and you're just gently going, uh, scrubbing down the face, very gently. You can do circular motions, you can go across. You want to really get in and make sure you get all the areas. Get in on your nose where the blackheads will want to live. So this is a, I'm using the Firm Skin Peel. There's also, also the Bright, Calm, Clear, and Firm. And what, what you're doing right now is a very gentle um, alpha hydroxy acid peel, unless you have the clear skin and you also have a little beta hydroxy acid. So you are, this, this product is breaking the keratin bonds between the cells and saying, okay, let's get off the skin now. So anything, um, and by the way, I get really red over anything. If you're like me, this is normal, but just know I am get red over anything. <laughs> So I just really want to make sure I get all my face down my neck and if this were white um, you would see even a little bit of color even if your makeup's already gone because those are dead skin cells. Yay! That we've broken the keratin bonds between and they have come off. And for good measure we take the excess and we get the back of our hands because let's have our hands age well as well. Okay that was step two. So we've done cleansing and we've done our mild exfoliation. And now we're ready to move on to what's called a warm treatment. Either You're either gonna have your lime stimulating mask or your eight greens mask. And I'm gonna explain as I'm letting my skin um, absorb this, why this is so amazing. So I'm using lime stimulating, okay, it's green. Add just the teeniest little bit of water to this. And you're gonna to wanna to massage this in as well. Oh my goodness, this smells so good. I've been using it for eight years and I still love the smell of it so much. Go down your neck. I'm going to start to get red and blotchy and you're going to be thinking, what is this woman doing? So Eminence is one of the only companies that does something called a warm treatment and it is stimulating your skin. We're basically creating a, um, a fake, if you will, uh, reaction. Okay. We, and by doing that, the skin is saying, okay, something's going on. Let me bring some extra blood flow to the area uh, to to help. And so by doing this, we're bringing the extra blood flow brings water in the form of blood flow, oxygen, nutrients, the capillaries open up wide. So if you're having any um, stagnancy anywhere, that's going to kind of be flushed. Now, your skin will get red. It's going to stay red for a little bit. But what we like to say in the eminence world is the redder the better and the reason being is the more of a flush you're going to get the more of a t detoxification you're going to get the more of a stimulation you're going to get um the, the better your skin is going to look tomorrow morning okay don't worry about tonight if you go to bed blotchy it's okay i will <laughs> okay so i'm starting to get a little red here normally i get a little redder a little faster so this is interesting um Yeah, it's an amazing product. So I just want you to know that the redness is normal. You are not having a bad reaction. You're having a good reaction. And I've used these products on probably close to a thousand people, maybe more, in my um, eight years with Eminence. And every single person that leaves the facial with this or uses it at home just loves the results. Okay, you can see the reddening starting to happen on my neck. Um, if you're having breakouts, this is going to bring, as I said, blood flow to the area. So you're going to have white blood cell activity. And white blood cell activity is great because it can help clear up an infection. So if you have a cystic lesion underneath the skin that you can't get it, get it to exit, um, it's going to help with clearing that. Okay. All right. And you don't necessarily have to massage it that long, but it just feels good. And massage is good for the tissues. And since I can't be the one massaging people right now, if we're still, like if people are watching this during the COVID-19 fiasco, <laughs> um, I miss massaging you people. Okay, so once that's set on, you can leave that on for five to 10 minutes. It does self-neutralize. So say you left it on 20 minutes and you forgot, it's gonna be okay. Um, and besides the fact that it's making your skin red, um, the ingredients of the lime, the citrus has vitamin C, there's all kinds of ingredients, or whether you're using the eight greens and you're working on hormonal balance, um, those ingredients that are also in there are going to just be benefiting the skin. So no need to worry. But 
five to 10 minutes is, is fine for tweeting. Okay, so I gently take off that, uh, the lime stimulating mask. And now, so that, so it gets confusing because you have two masks. That's a warm mask. And now I have my secondary treatment mask. Right now I have, the, there you go. You can see the redness starting to come up. Now I have the citrus and kale C and E mask. This one, if I can get a little bit out here. There we go. Um, C and E. So this is an anti-aging mask. And all of these you can just rub in with your hands, but I'm also going to show you if you want to use your brush. So that was me um, just putting it on with my hands. If you prefer, you could put a little bit into your hand, depending on what which mask you end up with here because of which skin type you have. Uh, can't get any more out. Okay, there we are. You can also um, just gently paint it on your brush oh that actually feels really good might remind you of being at the spa <laughs> which is kind of what we're going with here and eminence masks you don't need to look like missed out fire you don't need to see oh look she's wearing a mask it's working their products are so well formulated that they really drop into the skin so it's not just something sitting on the top treating your epidermis it's dropping in and treating your epidermis the skin you're seeing currently and the dermis the skin cells and stuff that are coming up, okay? That's a beautiful thing. So as I was saying about the Citrus and Kale C&E mask, it's an anti-aging mask with um, vitamin C, obviously, and vitamin E. And the E boosts the effective effectiveness of the vitamin C, protects against free radical damage, um, and can help with firmer, younger com looking complexion, okay? So in the um, beauty of not having this video go on for three hours, I will remove this. But say so you're gonna take a bath and enjoy your bath bomb or whatever else you got in your self-care kit. At this point, you could um, hop in your bath and just relax. This mask can stay on a long time. With the citrus and kale one, if you had left it on a longer time, it almost tightens up a little bit. So taking some actual like water and splashing that on your face can be helpful. Right now I can just get it off pretty easily with the washcloth can't see very well in here so I'm gonna take a look in my mirror there we are okay so I've done four out of five steps and now it's time to moisturize and I have the arctic berry radiance cream so I'm gonna put that on and now remember you'll still probably be a little bit red from your warm treatment and that is fine Warm treatments are just typically but done best at night because then you can just go to bed and uh, rejuvenate, regenerate. But in this weird time of COVID-19 and if you're just hanging out of your house, do it anytime. Just know that you might stay red for one to three hours, red to pink. And once again, the redder the better. And why? The more blood flow, the more detoxification, and the plumper, okay? So you get done and you think, okay, my skin looks pretty good, but really take a good look the next morning, okay? Because uh, plump, juicy skin awaits. And then hopefully you have some other Eminence products. You can put on a good um, eye cream. And should you have serum at home, you can put that on underneath of um, your moisturizer. So I'll put a little eye cream on. So that's your DIY self-care kit and a little bit of information about Eminence. And if you have any questions, you can feel free to reach out to us. You can follow us on um, Instagram and Facebook at LoverSkinPDX, our website, LoverSkinPDX.com. And I think that's all. Thank you for taking the time to listen and I hope you enjoy your DIY self-care facial.